Hello and welcome back to channel T Lover. So if you are new to this channel, please subscribe to this channel and also do not forget to click on our bell icon for our latest update. Today also I am back with you bringing a new topic for you. So in the content of today, we are getting the free edu mail for student GitHub pack. So if you want to apply for the GitHub student developer pack and if you want to get the free edu mail, then, then this video is very helpful for you. Please do not skip any part of this video. And if you are totally new visitor on our channel, then our channel provides you the free domain and hosting for your website. And if you have successfully built the website and if you have successfully built your website and if you are searching for the traffic for your website, then there are a lot of videos which will provide you the free traffic for your website as well as will provide you the free edu mail free github student pack free bcc card and lot of technology update related to ai and many more so, okay beside this if you have any problem regarding monetization and ads in error then you can directly make a contact on tlover2054 in the instagram so that i can help for you next one is this is my blog there are a lot of useful content on my blog please go through this blog without wasting our time we will apply for the free github student pack and we will get the free edu mail from this video okay so let's go for it so for that you have to just go for the new tab of any browser you may like here i am using the chrome and you have to go for this website so i'll provide this applying college link in the description below you can check out this or you can manually type this link as i have shown in the e screen so let's go for it before that i want to tell you that we are going to apply for this community college of philadelphia and we are getting the edu mail from this website so for that you have to just go for this link ccp.edu and you have to just click on the apply to apply for this website or I'll provide this link in the description below so that you can directly apply for this website. Before applying for this site, you have to just go for the create an account because you need an account to go further for this website. So let's fill up this information and we'll create an account in this website. Okay. To apply for this website, you need the fake address and you can find fake address from this website. Just enter the link that I have shown in the screen. So this is the fake address generator website. Just go for it. And we are going to apply for the United States. So make sure you have selected the United States. So in this fake address homepage, just scroll down and you can find this option. So just go for this respective link and you can find the fake address of this website. Okay. So just scroll down. So this is the name of that person. Copy this name. Now we'll create an account using this profile. Just go for this pasting. Here I have successfully pasted the first name and last name. But in this email address, you have to provide your own email address so that you will receive confirmation in your mail. Okay. You can use temporary mail also, but I suggest you to use your own mail. Okay. Here after providing the information of name and Gmail. You have to skip this phone number because there is no mandatory option. So just skip this one. And now you have to provide your date of birth. Okay. So for that, you have to just go for the fake address and you can find the date of birth of that person. Copy it and paste in that date of birth. After you have provided the date of birth of that person, you can just go for the entry team. So just drag this option. After you have provided the birth date, you can see the entry term and just, and just drag this option and you can find this summer 2023 season beginning in the May and July. So just select that first one and you have to create a password to go for creating account in this profile okay now you have to resolve this recaptcha and after that you can just go for the create an account so finally you can see that our account has been created and they have sent a mail in our gmail so that we have to verify this mail using our gmail so just let's go for the gmail to verify our mail as you can see that we have received mail from ccp request so just click on that respective link and you can find the click here to activate option so just click on that click here to activate and we can found in that mail that we'll get the ccp.edu mail from this website. So finally, we have activated our account. Now we can go for the apply online to go further for this website. So just click on that apply online. Now signing with your same account that you have recently created. Here after you have provided your email and password, you can just go for the signing to get signing in this website. Now a new page will load and you can go for the start a new application to go further for this website. Here we have already selected the summer 2023 session. So we will just go for the start application. In this space, you can see that first name and last name has been successfully added. So here my gender is female in this fake address. So I'll just select that female gender. Your email address is already selected. We'll skip this part. Now we'll go for the permanent address of this website. Okay. So now we'll go for the permanent address of this person. For that, we have already got the fake address. Now we'll paste this fake address in this respective address box. So just go for the street address, city name, state, zip code, respectively. Okay. As you have successfully fill up this information, as you have successfully fill up this information, I suggest you to save this page because you need this page for further verification of your information. 
so you can see that we have successfully saved this whole page and we can access for this page you can also make the screenshot of this page to access for the further okay now we'll just again go for the same application so here in these two options you have to just select for the as for the both option and scroll down and just provide your phone number okay so we will use the phone number to verify for this so for that we will use the temporary phone number that is provided by website that i will show in the screen okay here for accessing for the virtual phone number you have to just go for the receive sms.com and here you can go for the phone number copy this respective phone number and you have to just paste in the respective website and paste the phone number you have just recently copied okay so in this option you have to just click on the allow to text you and after that you have to just go for the save and continue now we have redirected to the demo graphics so here you have to provide your citizenship status so just select one so in this citizen status you have to just select one and you can go for the united states citizen after that you have to provide your social security number you can find this number in this fake address so just scroll down and you can find the social security number like this so just copy this one go for the new tab paste like this and you have to remove this dash option so that this will not affect in our application so this is not accepted by application we'll just copy this again and we'll paste that social security number in our application so here we go for selecting the application so after pasting your social security number you can go for this option or you can skip this one because this is not mandatory at the end of this page you can find this option how do you plan to pay your tuition fee so select one and here you have to select for the sale playing with tuition payment installment plan so just go for the save and continue again there is a student type first time student as for student readmit student so there are a lot of type of student here you have to select the one of the type of student so that just scroll down and select for the first time student after that in the academic program you can find the intended program of study so here you have to select the computer because we can learn the computer from the online so you can apply for the online courses for this college okay so just select the computer information system and after that just scroll down this is the entry term we have already selected this now we'll just go for the do you plan or enrolling full-time or part-time so just scroll down and we'll select for the part-time so after that just scroll again down and at which location we will prefer to take majority of class so scroll down and we can find the option for the i would prefer to take my course online so just select that first option and go for the save and continue again now our next page will load and in this space the academic status is asked for you okay so for that you have to just scroll down and you can find the school name or city name so here you have to provide your school name or city name here i am going for the respective city name because we do not know the city school name so we'll just go for the fake address again so we have the city as philadelphia just copy this one and after go for this application again and paste that city name just make a back space and you can find the number of school name like this so just select one of the state so here i am selecting for the obran lincoln high school after selecting your school name your mandatory option is already selected for yes leave as it is and after that year of high school you have to just provide it at 2011 okay so do not enter more than 2011 and after that you have to just go for the save and continue again now finally we are in the page of signature and here you have to some information to verify for this application okay so just scroll down and here you have to go for the each english your primary school language so select one go for the as do you certify the following and at the last of this page you have to provide your signature and that is your personal name so i just suggest you to go for the same website again this is the name of that person copy this name after copying the name of that person go for the application again and paste the name of that person as it is in the fake address so after making these all you have to just click on the preview before submission and you can find the all of the fill of information that you have recently created for this person to apply for this college and you can check all this information is correct or not make sure you have fill up the correct information and after that you have to just scroll down at the bottom of this page and at the last you can just go for the submit application to go for applying for this college okay after getting this you will receive the mail from this website as you can see that we have successfully applied for this website and after that we will receive the mail from this respective website in our respective gmail that we have provided and in that gmail we will receive the mail to get login in this account for this college and we will able to access for the free edu mail provided by this college okay so it might take 12 hours to 48 
or to get the mail from or reply from them so just wait for it till then please subscribe to the channel and like the video if you like this video and i want to tell you that there are a lot of option to get github student pack so i have shared a lot of option in my videos please go through them and we'll click on this view option to look that we have applied for the respective college or not so just click on that view and we can see that we have successfully applied for this college and they will make a reply in our mail so that we can access for the edu mail provided by this okay after i have received the mail from this respective college i'll be again back with you bringing the next part of this video so that we'll teach you how you can go for the edu mail and access for this edu mail so this is the website which will provide you the free edu mail and this is how you will apply for this website and you will receive the mail and from that mail you can access for the edu mail and you can create a student github pack using that mail okay i have shared a lot of videos in which we have created a student github pack using the verified email and verified id card so if you do not know how to create id card for your student github pack then there are a lot of video regarding this topic please go through my channel and you can get this useful trick on my video so this is how you can apply for the edu mail and get the edu mail for github student pack if you like the video please hit up the like option do not forget to click on the subscribe and bell icon for our latest update still if you got any confusion if you got any error then you can directly make a contact on till over 2054 in the instagram I'll be again back with you bringing more content like this. Till then have a good day. Till our official channel like, share and subscribe will value our support. Thanks for watching this video. Thank you.